And it's Starfield time. We need your help, Starfield. Andros has declared war. No, wrong game. Time to do some mining. Is else to this is the real reason I got this game. No, I can talk to you. Troy. Ow, it actually takes, I take damage. <laughs> and he stops mining. Oh, no, he doesn't stop mining. Oh, now you stop. Oh, now you restart. Oh, no. Can't do that. Very well. I'm going interrupt people by trying to talk to them. Hey, ho, ho, ho. Watch where you're waving that hey, thing. Watch it. Well, why has this guy got no... Careful. Why does this guy react to being What's zapped, but she you? didn't? What are you waiting for? Dig. I don't take orders from ghosts. I like mining. Mining is fun. Hey, watch it. <laughs> Careful. Your helmet makes a funny sound when I smash it. What's wrong with you? I like the noise your head makes. Hey, What's wrong with watch you? it. Collateral damage, sorry. I'm not familiar with musical rocks though. That's a little weird. Ooh, hello. I'll take that. Why is it a PS3 starting up? And now we get to design the character. Nope, that ain't me. Yes, so I was dyeing my beard, and I sneezed, and I like the way it looks, so I just ran with it. Once again, I give him the jaw that I wish I had, which is any. Let's make some predictions here. What background do we think Zack is going to take? Gangster for shotgun certification? Ah, but it's also got boxing and theft. I like the shotgun certification on Gangster, but I don't really care for the boxing part. Maybe soldier for the, for the, the jetpack and uh, the ballistics. Soldier, I could just straight up pick that one. I mean, that would make a lot of sense. I think Zach might be long a hauler, considering how much time he spends with uh, Snow Runner. Space trucker, I want to be a space trucker. Pistol certification, piloting, and persuasion. Oh, we're gonna go with space scoundrel. I like I like space scoundrel. Yeah, this is a guy from Elder Scrolls. So no, nah, I don't I don't I don't want. I don't want that. We don't want Elder Scrolls guy hanging around, do we, Starfield Zack? No, no, we don't. That sounds real dumb. We don't want that. We don't want the adoring fan on our ship because he sounds dumb and I don't like him. Starfield Zack has got some soulful eyes. Good Lord. And some pouty lips. Parents are alive and well. You can visit them at their home, but you'll automatically send... <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm not sending them any money. <laughs> That's my money. Yeah, that's my money. I'm keeping all of it. <laughs> that's me, me. That's Starfield Zack. I'm going to pick this one. And, none, and nothing else. Oh, look at the little rat. <laughs> look at him. He's a friend. Kind of ironic seeing a former combat medic out for the count with a head injury. But hey, it's what you signed up for. <laughs> so, who are you? A constellation oh. contact is on approach. Wait, the explorers group? I thought they were kind of a joke. Not a joke. You're just too young to know better. Hey, I'm just saying they got a reputation. Hell, I bet half the crew here doesn't even believe they really exist. Half the crew doesn't believe Earth exists, <laughs> but it's still there. Same with Constellation. Have the Flat Earthers been right, replaced Dusty. with Earth Denialists? Yeah, Put your helmet on. Earth doesn't exist, but if it does, it's flat. It only took us 45 minutes to make our character. Can you believe it? Ooh, 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 free stuff. Free stuff, med pack. Give me the gun. Give me the gun. Give me the gun. It's gun rants time. Guys, it's gun rants time. Yep, yep. That's a gun, all right. I, uh, I was able to detect that it was a gun. Is this a nerf gun? Uh, okay. I'm assuming this right here is the safety based on the fact that there's an S and then that. Maybe this thing on the front is like the magazine, quote unquote. It looks like this tips upwards, which is kind of strange. I kind of dig those sights. They kind of remind me of the like gutter snipe sights from the ASP pistol. How you doing? Hey, watch it. Sorry, sorry. I have to make sure. What's wrong with you? Uh, there's ghosts around here. These people can't be interacted with. Look, there's Careful. ghosts. Do you see the ghosts? There's ghosts. Greetings, alien. We come in peace. Just kidding. No, he's a ghost too. Spirit, the 
scanners on the frontier are reporting a ship coming in hot from orbit. That's not good. I really thought I lost them. Damn oh, it. shit. Don't worry, guys. I got this road cone. I'll throw it at them. Now they won't come up here because they'll know about the road cone. They'll see the road cone and be like, oh, we can't go there. That is a neat cone, though, actually. I kind of want it back. We'll, we'll get it after the fight. Why are you immediately going into combat? Look, they're peaceful. Excuse me, sir. Would you mind not shooting my friends and I? Are those peaceful bullets? How do I melee you? That seems pretty cool. I keep on accidentally crouching because I think it's the melee button. How do you melee? I forget again. Oh, I'm dead. Hold on. hey -ya! Oh my god, I think I might be on fire. You can't take- you can't take off! Ah! Ooh, Frenzy Ripshank. Ooh, and another gun! Oh, we're, we're still fighting. Sorry, I got distracted. Oh god, Road Cone didn't make it! Hey, he's fine! You guys, he made it! Road Cone made it! So, you gonna apologize for that? Or do I have to rough you up? Sorry, I swapped my controls around. That wasn't me crouching to give you a blowjob. I just swapped my crouch with my... Shut up! And we got this thing. Oh, that's kind of fun. That's that's kind of neat. This thing is interesting. Also, that magazine is chunky. It kind of reminds me of a combination of a, several different guns. This, this right here reminds me of the Beretta ARX. The bolt really gives me Origin 12 vibes. I like that you can see the spring all coiled up in there. That's that's pretty cool. And then the sight system looks a lot like uh, the sights that CZ used to ship with um, the CZ Scorpion Evo. It's also odd that there's like a laser emitter coming out of what I presume would be the gas tube. It's not without precedent, though, because, like, the MP5 had a laser emitter that you could attach through the cocking handle tube, which looks like a gas tube, but isn't actually a gas tube. Yeah, that's an, that's an interesting, that's an interesting gun. That, those rifling grooves are deep. It's kind of funny how deep those are. I would assume this is the selector lever. It's kind of positioned oddly, though, because that, that, to me, looks like it's going to be really hard to hit with your thumb. Um... You know, you know, Barrett. Hey, you did good there. Kept your head. I uh, did. You see the little bucket friends? There's two. You can see one there, and there's one there. You like, a, you like the little bucket friends I met? All right, fine. You're not in the mood. You dug up the artifact, right? That means you saw it. The vision. No, I wasn't paying attention. You're coming with me to Constellation. You're part of this now. What? No, I wasn't paying attention. I swear. I, I'm terrible at paying attention. I, I swear. Get out of here, Dusty. You're on to bigger things. No way, not my job. I refuse to be the savior of the universe again. Don't you get it? You don't have a job here anymore. You're with those explorers now. Like it or not. No. Just go, all right? Figure out what happened to you when you touched that rock. Oh, and hey, take this. You'll find it very useful out there. And it even tells the time. Ooh, free watch! Hell yeah! Damn, all these people are so nice. No, but seriously, you can't just fire me. You have to give me two weeks' notice. I'm on contract. I wouldn't take a dangerous job without a contract, would I? The way I see it, Constellation needs that artifact, but they also need you. This mystery is only getting bigger each step we take. And you're part of it now. Okay, but why can't you come with me? Is there only room for one person on your ship? What kind of crappy ship do you have? Technically, it's not even mine. Consider it alone. Also, shouldn't I stay here and heal these people? I am a combat medic. Granted, some of them can't be salvaged, and we don't really care about the pirates, but uh, some of these folks are looking a little... Better not be coming out of our pay. A little worse for the wear. A little tired. Yeah, see this guy right here? See, you can't tell me people don't need my help. Look at this guy. He's just straight up dead. So obviously he doesn't need my help anymore, of course, but there are other people out there who aren't dead that would need my help. Just gotta scavenge the battlefield, as you do. Hey, you got any good hits in? Not every day we get to cut anything other than rocks. Look at this guy. I found one. This guy needs medical assistance. Before I get off this planet, I gotta help this guy. Where were you shot? Where was your appendix ruptured? Do you have your appendix? You have seven? Why are you collecting them? 
In case one ruptures? Oh, good foresight. Hey, Bosco. Bosco, you're kind of cute, not gonna lie. <sighs> so is Captain that... Mike. Ha! Ah. I assume you know how to fly a Class A starship. As Barrett likes to say, it's as easy as learning to ride a bike. I will attempt to boost the shield, just in case there are any difficulties. Alright, well, I guess we should actually get going and do stuff. Shields ready. The rest is up to you. Um... Goodbye, everyone! It's been fun! I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty sweet being able to fly a ship. Adequate pilot. Are you familiar with ship combat tactics? Ooh, okay. Because that's a crimson fleet ship bringing its weapons to bear. Yep, this is just me shooting this guy. I'm just gonna you know, missiles as well. I'm just gonna hit all the buttons. I mean, I'm doing a pretty good job of goofing him up. I think I handled it. This thing then. Crimson fleet ships are hey, do you mind? I'm looting engine. here. All right, fine. Guys, I got an overlay on my screen and I can't fucking actually see or any. I can't actually see or shoot at anything. Help! Oh, it's because I'm in scanner mode. Damn it! All right, I, I got it. I got it. Oh, I probably can dock. Let's do that, and then maybe take you guys out manually. Who's that? Are you just waiting for me? If I come in without a weapon drawn, I come in peace. Nope, never mind. Never mind, you don't want to come in peace? Fine, you die. You die in peace. Alright, yeah, you're out of ammo now, chump. I counted the bullets. Well, it's not a very big ship from what I've seen, and also there's a lot of blood on it. I don't know if I want that. Zach is, wait, who the hell is that? Hey, I didn't say you could leave yet. Captain, Protocol Indigo dictates that I am to return to the Lodge with no deviations. We are here to stop the Crimson Fleet from pursuing Vasco, come back. nothing more. You can blame it all on me. Oh, Vasco, come back. Why does trust me with his ship? Barrett is very interested in that stupid artifact you picked up and wants you to deliver it to Constellation, but they are also stupid. But what am I to say? I'm just a robot, and I don't make decisions, so do that thing, stupid. How do you do combat? Is that a cannon in your chest right there? Show me how you fight! Let's skirmish! It's time to duel! While I am programmed for combat, it is not my primary function. Is it your anything function? Look, friends! They're trilobites! They, they are actually kind of friend-shaped. Ew, gross! Enemies to kill with the pistol! No, don't kill the trilobite! Trilobites are friends, probably. It is kind of terrifying, but I like him. I'm not gonna kill him because he's maybe a friend. Can I scan this guy? Be careful, Captain. Alien creatures are often unpredictable. No reason to kill them, they're just chilling. Stop making noises though, it's weirding me out, I don't like it. You, you stay over there. Be careful, Captain. Alien creatures are- What was that you saying? Something about them being unpredictable or something? I would consider this victory cause for celebration. Whoa! That's huge. Oh wow! Okay, I uh, I forgot I was on a moon with low gravity, so when I jumped, I got really freaked out by my really high jump. Ooh! <laughs> Look at these guys! Oh, they're kind of cute. Oh my god, he's like doing little leaps. Yo, why put this fence here if I can just straight up jump over it? <laughs> 
They put the fence in, but they forgot about the gravity. Whoop. You idiots! This is like 2% gravity! Woo! Oh shit, there's a big thing. What is that? I don't like that. What is that? Whoa, what the fuck is that? I don't like that at all. I don't like that one bit. No, 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 no. Oh my god, my god is doing like nothing. Uh, Bo Bosco, Bosco, I need help. Get, get the Crete! The Crete are here to save me! <laughs> get him, Crete! Oh, we're, we're, we are in trouble, boys. We are in big trouble. Oh shit. Yeah, we're, we're gonna have to go out like a man. Yeah! <laughs> First death, boys! Let's go! Oh no! Oh no! I got John Howard! Oh no! <laughs> Could you do this to me? <laughs> Here we go. Oh, there's a facility. That might be where Constellation is. Although if that is, it's a pretty big facility for only 10 people. Crazy. Yeah, it is. It's right there. I should have just walked straight into it. What do we got here? Canisters that explode if you shoot at them. Careful with that. Oh, the nitrogen. Are they? It's frozen canisters of slowy, slowy blue stuff. Oh my god, that just blows up. <laughs> why did I think that why why on earth? Why in a million years did I not think it would blow up? I see a bucket. I see a bucket. Look, I put a bucket and a bucket inside a bucket. And there's another road cone. All right, what? Fine, 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 fine. Injury received. <laughs> oh no, Bosco, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just yeeted the cone across the room and it hit Bosco. <laughs> I, I'm not. I'm not even. I'm not even two hours into the game and I've already hurt my only friend. <laughs> I don't see anybody. This place is unpopulated. Is it? Oh wait, no, it's populated by corpses. This one goes in my scrapbook. I use the door as cover. Wait, no, I got my robot. I gotta get the kill before he does. Otherwise, I'm not gonna be able to level his skill up. Oh, you didn't have to do that. You didn't have to die, but you did. Oh, did they see my flashlight? Shit. You appear to be prioritizing your deaths. Yay, I got him! What the heck is this thing? What is this goofy thing? It's like a weird revolver. This is weird looking. Yeah, I don't really see any way that the bullets... If this is the magazine, I don't really see any way that the bullets get from here to here. Okay, yeah, so that is the magazine. I don't... Yeah, I don't really see how the bullets get from here... The masseuse, the top of it's probably right about here. So I don't really see how they go from there to up there. But it's kind of neat looking. I like this little piece of wood right here that doesn't even need to be there. Teleportation bullets? It's probably teleportation bullets. It's a future gun! And future guns do future things! The terror morph is loose! I repeat, the terror morph is loose! Do not engage! The terror morph? Sounds like they're having fun without me! Excuse me, do you have any stim packs? I need them stim packs. Classic United Colony. Put something in a cave until it kills you. <laughs> One more time. Are they listening? So I wonder if they, um, I wonder if they made the Terror Morph here. Oh, look at these guys. They're friends. Eggman Desk Assistant. Oh my God. Yeah, we'll take that. We're putting the Eggman des Desk Assistant on the ship, Bosco. Might need to play this a bit more carefully if I want to survive. Oh wait, med kit. 
I survived to live another day. I'm leveling up my medicine skill. I'm learning how to patch people up because I'm patching myself up. Wait, 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 wait. So, uh, did you see? Did you see how far away I saw that? Boys, we got the legally distinct P90. Yeah, that is just like a P90 magazine. They, they 100% were just like, yep, P90. I don't understand this weird little shock absorber. That's a little strange that it's got a mountain bike shock absorber built into the grip. I don't know what the point of that is. I like how you can actually tell that the barrel goes like all the way back to here. That's really cool. The ammo counter is like an e-ink display. So that actually changes as you fire it, which is really neat. I kind of like how this has got like a weird exo frame on the gun itself. That butt pad is 100% just a P90 butt pad. That's really funny. That looks, that actually looks pretty cool. Oh yeah, your safety's up here. That's a little strange that it's a sliding safety, but the things that I think are weird about this is what does this lever right here go to? Why does it have like a little pneumatic piston on it? That sight radius is absurdly short, but whatever. It's a, it's a submachine gun, so. Ooh, a laser sight? Oh my God. You can get a laser sight for the Grendel. Come on, robot. This way. Yeah! <laughs> hey, how you doing? Ha! Uh, funny physics. Is that gonna explode if I shoot at it? It looks like a sharps container, so probably not. Anti-personnel modified rat. What? Whoa! It's got a muzzle brake on it. What the? Can, oh, okay. More damage against humans. How does a gun do more damage to humans? Uh, I guess you could say if it's like a hollow point. Whoa! This this quite literally looks like the Institute rifle from Fallout 4. Oh, I love this though. Oh, I love that there's like a little control panel on here. That's cool. There's like a little control panel on it and then you've got like a safe fire button. This is cool looking. I'm into this. I like the EOTech reticle, that's cool. There he is! I have Vosco! Image. Taking up like half the screen. Still not as bad as the Institute weapons. Hey, poutine! Poutine, oh, it just, it's just, oh, wait, there it is. Cheese curd, fried gravy, and love. Love. It's got love in it. A lot of dead scientists around here. Hayden Wynn. Structural material. What happened to your face, anyway? It's all partially liquefied. Is it moldy? How long have you been dead, buddy? Credits? Man, dude, I have been taking so long to go through this building. Oh! Someone's trying to jump our score. Hold them off here. My broken stuff up on the roof. I'm on it. No one's getting through. Whoa! Oh! Hello! So what happened to the people of this place? Were they attacked by pirates or did some natural event kill them and now the pirates are salvaging the area? Did they get a lead or did they cause their death? Hmm. No notes on whatever the heck that thing is. Curious about it though. So they were testing out bulletproof, nope, that's not a bulletproof glass. It's equations written, not written on a invisible whiteboard which sounds maddening. I think that would drive me crazy. See? Oh, he's got a little tiny friend, too! They didn't both have friends! Look! Ah! <laughs> look at these two! Bosco, look at them! Bosco's like, what an idiot. And balanced! I can't believe Barrett gave his ship to this goober. I'm detecting a safe nearby. We could make use of whatever is inside, provided you had some... Nope, nope, nope. I saw you. Yeah. The heat leech. You are what killed all these folks, aren't you? Admit it. Confess your sins. Ooh, nutrigen tissue. Chase dick. Oh, besides, everyone in here is dead, so that means that it is now my property because I found it first. Salvage rights! Salvage rights. I can 
hear the terror morph roaring somewhere. And more people screaming. God. The the terror morph? Yeah, we ran into him earlier. He's not nice. Oh, we got... Okay, they're standing right by an explosive canister, which is not smart for them. You gotta be kidding me. The Frontier has a new captain? You working with Barrett, or did you pry the ship keys out of his cold, dead hands? The ship doesn't have anything on it. You're chasing a fairy tale. I've heard enough out of you. Kill oh, I failed my first persuasion challenge of the game. That makes me sad. Oh, terrible. Oh, Brogan, you made a bad mistake. You want to surrender now? Last chance. Last chance. Literally. Come in over my head. Yeah, you are. Literally last chance. Okay, bye. Oh. Uh. Hey, guys. Sorry. I was in there for so long it became nighttime. Look, man. It's an explorer's group, and they aren't treasure hunters. They aren't? You sure? I mean, I'm pretty sure. You know what? Hell, you can come on the, you can come on the ship right now. I can't figure out how to put anything on the ship, so there's nothing on it. You, you mean that, don't you? You really haven't found anything on board? No, nothing. I'm just chasing a fairy tale, man. You're lying. We're getting what's on that ship. Shit! Sorry, Brogan, you had cool stuff and I wanted it. To reach the launch, we must jump to the planet Jemison in the Alpha Centauri system and then land in the city of New Atlantis. Okay. Do not worry. This will all become second nature before too long. Okay, I will do that, even though I feel like I'm really bad at this. Like, I see that there's a captain's locker, but is there, like, a ship inventory? Uh, whatever. We're just gonna keep going, and then hopefully I'll learn how to do stuff as I go on.